The fuse is blown. This capacitor is also blown up. Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, I have another power supply here to repair. This one is a 15 volt 3 ampere power supply. Let's connect the power supply to the AC mains and check the output. There is no output indication. The multimeter reading from the output of the power supply is showing zero value. Put the multimeter into AC mode and check the input. 230 volt AC is available at the input. Let's disconnect the power supply and find out the issue. Before we touching the PCB, make sure that we discharge the main filter capacitor. We can start the checking of the components from the input side. Put the multimeter into continuity mode. The main input is connected to the fuse. Let's check the fuse. We can see there is no continuity on the fuse. The fuse is blown. The fuse is blown because of the short circuit on the board. We have to check all the components in high voltage side. The output of the fuse is connected to the protection circuit. This one is an NTC thermistor here. It protect the circuit from inrush current. It is connected in series with the input voltage. If we check it, we can see it is conducting. This one is an MOV. Metal oxide varistor. It protects the circuit from high voltage surge. If the voltage increases, the resistance of the MOV decreases. Whenever the increased voltage reaches the rated voltage of the MOV, the MOV start to conduct and clamp the AC input lines together. Due to this reason, fuse will blow up and the circuit is protected from high voltage surge. The MOV is connected in parallel to the AC supply after the fuse. Now let's check this capacitor and EMI filter coil. Now, we can check the bridge rectifier. Put the multimeter into diode mode. which is also in good condition. Now let's check the MOSFET of the SMPS, which is used to drive the transformer. There is no issue on the MOSFET. Now we will check this main filter capacitor.
there is no capacitor reading on the multimeter. Seems this capacitor is damaged. Let's remove the capacitor from the PCB and check the value. This capacitor is damaged. This capacitor is in blown up condition. Maybe this capacitor was shorted. Due to that reason, the fuse was blown. The value of this capacitor is 100 microfarad, 400 volt. I have the same capacitor here, which I found from old PCB. Let's replace the capacitor and the fuse with the good one. Now we replaced the capacitor and the fuse. Let's connect the main supply wires and check the power supply. The output indicator of the power supply is on. Now let's check the output with multimeter. We can see the power supply is working now. We get 15 volts at the output of the power supply. That's all in this video. If you like the video please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.